Hello guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to another vlog. So today is Saturday as you can tell because we are still in bed and it's a pretty cloudy, miserable looking Saturday and it's meant to rain but Oh well, we do have some plans for today. We've had a humongous lion to the point where, well, we're still in bed and it's 11 o'clock. Obviously we've been awake, but um, yeah, it is 11 o'clock. So that is a good Saturday by all accounts. Um, but we need to get up, we're gonna have some breakfast. Then we've got a couple of bits we need to do today. We need to take Murray's suit to the dry cleaners. Oh, I need to go to the post office as well, so it's next door. So that's handy. So yeah, we need to take Murray's suit to the dry cleaners because he's got some graduation photo shoot thing at the end of September. So we need to go to the post office to drop off some ASOS parcels um, just to return them and need to go to H&M in town to return some H&M stuff. But we also need to buy a new duvet because we're sleeping with a blanket at the minute because our duvet was just really manky and i've been looking for an excuse to buy a new one basically i had it from like second year uni no i must have had it when i went to uni and then in second year uni i fell asleep drunk after a night out and spilt coke like all over it so it's always been a bit manky but we've just been like clinging on and then we spilt something else on it and it was just the final straw so I need to have a shower and do my makeup so yeah shouldn't take too long but we do probably need to get up sooner before it is actually lunchtime got a little lonely slice of toast because we'll be having lunch soon so i didn't want to have too much so I'm ready for the day. I just brushed my hair, popped a bit of dry shampoo in the roots and I'm all dressed. This top is from Miss Selfridge. It's like a thin high neck, not really high neck, but a bit of a high neck uh, short sleeve top. I've got a belt from River Island years ago and my Topshop mom jeans and Reebok classic trainers. So yeah. We're going for a chill, like, shopping vibe. Um, I might throw a blazer on over this because I don't think it's quite cold enough for a coat. It's actually, like, 15 degrees, so it's not too bad. So, yeah, I might throw a blazer on over this, but we shall see. So, I've just gone for this Topshop blazer, which I know and love, and I wear it literally all the time. I feel like this would take you seamlessly, seamlessly from summer into autumn and probably spring into summer as well. It's just... Honestly, if you haven't got a blazer like this, you need it. It's from Topshop and I'm obsessed. So yeah, this is the final shopping vibes look. So we're just heading off. We're going to go to the post office and the dry cleaners first to drop off that stuff. Got it in a heap by the front door so we can't forget it. So yeah, we're going to take that stuff first and then head into town. So we did the dry cleaning. I'm on my phone because I can't be bothered to get my camera out of my bag. But yeah, we did the dry cleaning and then the post office shuts at 1.30. We were outside the post office at 1.33. So, good. Yes. Um, so yeah, Murray's going to have to bring them another time if he can or I'm going to have to bring them another time because they'll shut tomorrow. So yeah, that's fun, but we're gonna head into town. We did the dry cleaning anyway, extortionate. I can see why we don't dry clean more things because <laughs> it was like nearly 30 pound, but you know, we've got to get done. So that's sorted, ready to pick up next Saturday. So I think we'll get food first, but we'll take you along with us. Went for a tuna melt panini and a caramel frappe thing. And um, Murray's got a hot chocolate and bacon and brie. So we are all done, actually. <laughs> that makes it a bit easier. So we're all done in muffin break. It was absolutely delicious. Um, we're not going to get a muffin. We were going to, but I think we're just too full. So we're not going to get a muffin today, but we'll definitely come back and get one because they look amazing. But I've got my H&M thing to return. I've got my receipts. So yeah, we're going to go do that now. We're in WH Smith because we wanted a calendar to go like in the kitchen so we can keep track of everything. But then we didn't really think we want a calendar 
in what month is it? <laughs> September. Um, so we're getting on 2021, so we'll have to hold out a bit, but we're getting the scenic views one because it's super pretty and there's bits from England and Wales and some of them were just England and I can't be dealing with that because I'm just leaving my heritage behind. But all the stationery stuff in WH Meth is just too cute. So we're all done, we went to H&M, returned the items and now we are walking back to the car in the multi-story and we're gonna head back home. Cause you forgot about us All you wanna do is fight Bringing me down every night Yeah, I think that I'd rather So be we're back at the flat But you know when people say like You know you're old when You know you're old when You go into town, pay for parking Walk around town all day Specifically to buy a duvet And then forget to buy A duvet So if you were watching, you're probably thinking, I swear they went in to buy a duvet. Yes, we did go in to buy a duvet and we didn't buy a duvet because we're stupid. So we are now going to pop to Dunelm, which is like a seven minute drive and we shouldn't have to pay for parking or anything. So it's okay. Um, and yeah, buy a duvet, I guess. Going to have to figure out what a tog is as well and how many togs we want. So that'd be fun. But we are going to get a duvet today, I'm determined, because I will be shut tomorrow because it's Sunday. So, gonna have to get one if we want an actual duvet to sleep with. So, yeah, we're gonna look for a duvet in Dunham. Made it to Dunham. It's gonna be hard to uh, refrain to just buying a duvet, but we'll see how we get on. Got a duvet, had a long discussion on what tog to get, but I think we've got a good one. Got 10.5. Uh, spring autumn because that is the weather we get even in the summer in the UK. So, yeah, happy with that. £16. Pounds. Managed to only come out with what we need. How impressive is that? Are you impressed, guys? I was quite impressed, actually. Anyone else find it, like, really weirdly therapeutic to go through a calendar and put people's birthday in? Or just me? Um, I know it's a long shot um, because it is only September, but I got excited about calendars and now I have a 2021 calendar. So I'm just going to go through it and put all the birthdays in. Special Longleat pen that I bought when we went to Longleat in February. So... Yeah, it's exciting. I'm just gonna have a cup of tea, stick something on TV. Murray's out working on his car, so yeah, I'm just gonna have a bit of me time. We're making chicken and chorizo risotto for dinner. It's amazing. It's one of my favourite meals, I reckon. And um, we have it quite a lot. We usually have it like at least once a month, I'd say. So yeah, we're just cooking up a storm in the kitchen. Have we got the other bowl? Yeah, they'll be clean, won't they? Oh yeah, they're there. Yeah. That's why we always use it first. The risotto is ready and the garlic bread is in the oven. Oh my gosh, it looks so good. Mmm, I'm really hungry now and I cannot wait to eat it. So we had dinner and it was a very lovely, wasn't it nice? Mm. Wasn't it nice? Even if I do say so myself. But now we are watching Hot Fuzz, which we've both seen upwards of a hundred times, I would say. And um, I love it. Could probably quote every word. But I'm just going to take my makeup off on the weekends. I'm super lazy and use makeup wipes because I can't be bothered to even stand at the sink. <laughs> I'm just taking my contacts out as well. And only contact wearers would understand, but that feeling when you take your contacts out after a long day. Ah, oh, it's the best feeling ever. So, yeah, I'm probably just going to take my makeup off, finish hot furs, and then go to bed. And we're super excited to sleep under our new duvet. We put it all together earlier, and oh my gosh, it's like so squishy. I don't think I realised how flat our old duvet had got, but yeah, I'm really excited. So we're probably going to head to sleep after this, so I guess I will catch up with you in the morning. Oh, well, well, look who isn't saying hi until like nearly four o'clock. So I do have my reasons. Well, I guess I don't really, but my reason is I just haven't filmed. Excuse the like towel hanging on the door in the background by the way, they're just drying. Um, but yeah, I haven't filmed because I've actually been using my camera to take Instagram pictures and I got quite a few actually. I did about four different outfits, so not loads, but definitely something to like drip into my feed over the next um, few weeks. 
they're more sort of autumnal outfits so yeah I'm really excited for that and I also made a preset for my Instagram as well if you don't follow me it's at Emily Caris underscore wears I always have it linked in the description as well and I'm really enjoying being on that platform at the minute and posting pictures I feel like at the turn of every season I have I have a really big like fashion hype and love styling new outfits and things like that so yeah I'm excited for it but I have just chucked on well I wore this bars out on Friday night but I only had it on for like three hours or something so I've just popped this on it's from Under the Stories very cute and a pair of jeans and I've got a cup of tea and yeah I've got this darker lipstick on which I'm absolutely loving it's making me feel very autumnal it's Charlotte Tilbury Bond girl and I'm just obsessed so yeah Murray's working on the car again bless him trying to get it drivable because he's got work in the morning but yeah I'm gonna start I haven't mentioned this really in my vlog um so far but I have got a job interview um a week tomorrow so I'm gonna have a bit of a read of this just to recap um obviously not the whole thing because it's massive um and I think Murray's coming back in anyway but I'm just gonna have a skim through I've been watching webinars and listening to podcasts and everything so yeah hopefully I'm getting prepped for that but yeah Murray is back in by the sounds of it hello, hello. <laughs> so yeah i'm just gonna have a flick through i think and have a bit of a read finish my cup of tea and soon it'll be time for dinner but we do also have a pile of dishes so we'll fight over who wants to do those <laughs> but yeah we're having a good day we're having a chill day sorry i haven't vlogged but i've been getting content of another sort but yeah i'm gonna crack on with what i just said and i'll catch up with you a bit later while pretending so i'ma make it easy for us both because i don't even want your love want your love so fill you in cookie dough was amazing so good really tasty um and the chai milkshake, which was the thing that I was like, oh, I'm not sure, like, it might be a bit weird, but I really wanted to try it. Oh my gosh, it was so good. It was literally, like, I don't know, just like spiced ice cream, I suppose. It made me feel very autumnal, which, again, not sure how to feel about it, but yeah, I really enjoyed it. It was a very nice treat, obviously very naughty and very um, expensive, actually. <laughs> I am gonna head to bed now because it's late. What time is it? My gosh, it's nearly half ten and obviously I have work in the morning. Murray's on mornings next week so he's getting up at like, oh god no, it's like quarter to five I want to say. I'm going to leave it there. Thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy, please give this video a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe down below if you haven't already. And I will see you in my next video. Bye!